hello guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another breakdown video so a request was made to break down this video so let's listen and then do a breakdown So so fun. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know that, yeah. Wow. So let's get on with the breakdown. Let's get on with the breakdown. Yeah. Alright, first thing to note, what's key? F. Okay, so let's listen to that first part again. Alright, very simple there. Alright. So you could just use this as um, uh, a substitution for your two chord. So let's take an example. We give you glory, Lord, as we are you. See that there? Using that for my two chord. Okay, so I'm playing D, E, D. Then you play C or you play G and F on your left. You hit the F and then you go A, B flat. Got it? Let's move on. So, um, yeah, so that you could use as a passing to the sixth. Let's take an example. Thank you, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Yeah, so let me show you what it's doing. G, A, then you play this. A and G in the left and then D in the right so then you play G D and then you cut this so we have A C sharp E so I think he suspended this um, G let me hear that again Okay, he suspended the A, not the not the G. So he did. Yeah. So when you play this, you play this. This would remain here. You do. Da, 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 da. E, G to the sixth. We have D, F, A, C, F. All right. Let's move on. Ah, I think I might know that, yeah. Yes. Yeah, let's take that part. I think he played something else there. Did he? Okay, okay, yeah, I think he's on the two there. So, uh, we'll take this part. Uh, right, and then we can use this as a passing to the... So, so let me show you an example in the song and then I'll show you the movement. So, there are new every morning, new every morning, great is thy faithfulness, O Lord, great is thy faithfulness. Yeah, so here's what he's doing. We take this um, C to D, and then we have A, D, F sharp. Then he did something like this. So you play C, and then you play G and A. So then 
D and B flat, C and A, B flat and D. Why is still maintaining this D and A though? So. Then it did. So we have a diminished here. B flat, C sharp, E, B flat. Then we have A, C, E flat, A. You can add the C there and it takes you to the to the two. So okay, so let's move on. Yeah, that. That's something you could use again as a passing to the sixth. Let's take an example. How great is our God? Sing with me, how great. Yeah. This is one of those chords you hear and it sounds so soulful. This is it. <laughs> Once you just get it and you get the sound, anytime you hear it, you'll be able to detect it. So, he's playing. I think he played that full. So, he's playing E, G, B in the left and then you play D F A and of course if you notice it's a combination of two chords it's called a chord combination which is E minor and D major so it's kind of playing like a 2 5 in the key of D minor so 2 this is a 2 and then he plays his 5 this way so we have A G C sharp F A okay so we have right to the sixth yeah so if you have something like um our dear pounded for waters of my yeah so you could use that yeah pass to your six okay i like that one too mm, i like that stuff you did yeah um Uh, this is a really simple movement, but you know, it's very, very sweet. So let's see where we can use it in the gospel song. Um, let's take the song. Yes, Jesus loves me. So you can use this as a passing to the four, right? Just use it as a passing to the four. It's very soulful, right? Uh, I have decided to follow Jesus I have decided to follow Jesus so yeah you could use that as a passing to the four so we have here E G A C E then you hit the C so and then you can play your four this way which is F B flat D and then F A D. Okay. Let's move on. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Okay, yes, I think, uh, yes, yeah, anyways, let's see where we can use that. I want to take this part, um, I'll take this part, uh, let's see where we can use this in the song, uh, let's take the song, um, I have decided, follow Jesus. I have decided to follow Jesus. I have decided. So you could use that as a condense, okay? As a condense. I'm using it as a condense, approaching the one. So, but you know, I just added this movement there because it did seem fit to add the movement, anyways. Yeah, so here's what he's playing. We have this F here and then D, E. G B flat. Then we have F sharp D E A. Then we have still this chord that you played before. So uh 
we have E G B D F A. So then he did this. So we have C sharp F B flat in the right. You do grace from C uh, F sharp to G. Right? And then in case you want to add what I added, you could play a diminish here. Um F sharp C E flat A to this E B flat D G hit the bass right because you're going to the one you could also even do something like let's say uh right I have decided to follow Jesus I have decided follow Jesus I have decided yes so you could try that there take the E flat to E and when you're in here you could just take this D to C sharp hit the bass and you you're back to the one all right let's continue Yes, I think he played something there before. Yeah. yeah. Let's 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 see that. We have um then um da 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 I think that's what I had. Yeah, yeah so um da 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 Before I play this stuff. He did so let me show you the movements da -da -da, da -da -da. so he's playing c d e why playing g a c e then this you play f a b flat d f um then da, you play d B flat. Then you play this E and C to F and D back to E and C then to um D and B flat. So okay, before he went here, um uh, yes. But before we before we before I show you that, um let me show you where you could use this in the song. This um uh Yeah, let's see where we can use it in the song. You are bigger than what people say. Je over you are bigger than what people say. You are bigger than what people say. Say, yeah, over you are bigger. What people say, yeah, some say. So you could use that deal, probably like a two five one, right? Because I would have gone. You are bigger than what people say. Uh, you go. You are bigger than what people say. Yeah, over you are two five one. So you could use that there in replace of that. So to this movement he did so diminished to the sixth. So if you have something like um uh, thank you, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Right, so here's what he's doing. We have um B A flat F, then we have C sharp. G B flat E. Now we are playing the inversions of diminish. Uh the diminish seven. E B flat C sharp G. G C sharp E B flat. B flat E G C sharp. C sharp G B flat E. E B flat C sharp G. G C sharp E B flat B flat E G 
C sharp and then you come to this which is A D G C so we have okay so let's move on You hear that? You hear that? Uh, I think. Da, da, da. Yes, I think I've done it. Uh, uh, a lesson on six two five one. So you could do well to check that out. I explained, you know, the movement behind the six two uh, five one chord progression. So, but this is kind of something we could use as a six two five one chord progression with this five. Yeah, this um, C um, triad. In drop tools as our six then we go to the two we can go to the five we can go to the one so let's try it in the song uh, mighty warrior great in battle jehovah is your name yes Mighty, so it's like a condense, right? So here's what he's doing. Drop two of C on the five. Because you could play the C over the six. It's like a chord combination. It's like an extension of the D minor. So instead of you could just omit the, the root and just play it as C major. Alright, so we have E, C, and G. C, G, E. Uh G e c so you play this c e g so your two you have your g f and then c f a you can play your five this way i'm just adding some stuff for you c g b flat d f right and i'm going to leave a link in the description box to the um, video on the six to five chord progression i did on youtube so you could do well to check that out and get more ideas on it, okay?